Uh, let's see. So, that does still beg the question, how the hell do I finish <laughs> Veronica's thing? I mean, seriously. I could make you care. Return to Veronica to the Brotherhood of Steel with Elder with the evidence to further misguided priorities. Uh, bring the pulse gun back to the Elder. I have the pulse gun. I... I... Uh, ugh. Okay, I am confused. I am very freaking confused right now. Uh, can I actually put this armor on? Uh, put on the armor. Plus two strength, minus two agility, and rad resistance. There we go. And plus three rad resistance. Ooh, that's almost completely de dead. Holy crap, I'm gonna need to repair this at some point. Uh, how does it look? Not quite as good as the full-on Brotherhood of Steel armor that uh, Veronica's wearing over there. But still, not too bad. But, yeah, it does beg the question. How the hell do I do this? I have a pulse gun. It is in my hand, right friggin' now. What do I do with it? Tell me! Tell me what I do with this gun! Uh, Elder, hello. Welcome back, my friend. Tell me about Helios. I don't care about Helios. Um. Bye. Veronica. Veronica. Hello. Veronica. I've got a gun. It's the pulse gun. It's the gun we were gonna go get, but I already had it. Um. What do I do? Hello? Veronica? You gonna... gonna say anything? Got a pulse gun pointed at your head? Not gonna say anything. Damn it. Damn it! What do I do? How do I do this? I don't know. She... she won't talk to me. I have a pulse gun. And now she's not even coming anymore. Is she mad that I pointed at her face? I'm sorry, Veronica. Uh, are you uncomfortable with the fact that I, uh, got naked in front of you? Yeah, you gonna talk to him now? I have the pulse gun. Pulse gun! Boom. Uh, hello? Veronica? Elder? Anything? No? <laughs> what the hell am I supposed to do with this? Oh. Can I just point it at my own head? Put myself out of my misery? Veronica? Veronica? Do I have to give her You're the pulse gun? The heavy stuff, aren't you? I'm gonna give you the pulse gun. Maybe, maybe that'll help. You now have a pulse gun. Give it to him. Show him. I... <laughs> Veronica, you have the pulse gun. Give it to him. Give it to him. Don't just stare at me. Give it to him. Fine, give it back to me. You're give it back to me. The heavy stuff, aren't you? No, I am taking my pulse gun back, because apparently you don't know what the hell you're doing. Pulse gun, give me the pulse gun. Now, I have the pulse gun. I have the pulse gun. Completed! Recover the pulse gun. Bring a pulse gun back to Elder Hidden Valley. Veronica, I have the pulse gun. Talk to him. Welcome back, my friend. What can I do for you? Tell me about Helios. Helios. Blah. Bye. <laughs> Why won't you give him the pulse gun? Damn it! Damn it! I have the pulse gun. It's in my hands. Well, it's not in my hands. It's in my inventory. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? No! 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 Ah! Damn it! What am I supposed to do? I don't know. I don't know. She won't say anything. Eddie never says anything. No one wants to talk. No one wants to interact. I have a pulse gun in my hand. I am blasting a friggin' everything, but nothing's happening. She... She is... is infuriating. I don't know what to do. I am completely confused. I have a pulse gun. I want to give you this pulse gun to show you that there is crap outside that's very dangerous to you, but you won't take it. She won't say anything. This is the gun you wanted. Right, 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 Veronica? Is it the helmet? Can you just not talk through the helmet? That could be very well be the problem. Ugh. You know what? I... I just don't know anymore. 
I don't know. I really, I really don't know. I have no idea. I am sick of this. I am sick of this. Veronica, you are infuriating. You are really, really annoying me right now. I just, you know what? I think it's time for us to just kind of go our own separate ways. Because damn it, damn it, Veronica. I mean, I thought you would be better than Boone. I mean, granted, you were a bit more annoying than Boone, always asking me for to get you a dress every time I try and give you something. But damn it, this is a, it, this is just annoying. I have the pulse gun. It's in my friggin' hand. I wanted to give it to the elder, but no, you just clam up. The one time I actually want you to talk, the one time you really should be talking, but no, you don't say a damn thing. You just stand there. You stand there and look at him, not saying a damn word. What the hell? What the hell? You know what? I am going back to the Lucky 38. I am going to the Lucky 38. I am going to buy up every single extra little storage and vanity item in that place. I am going to just decorate my place, and then I am just going to leave you there. I'm going to leave you there so you can sit there and wallow in the lap of luxury while I go out and try and find something else to do. Because you, you are worthless. Worthless. Okay, you're not worthless, but you're annoying the hell out of me. I have a pulse gun pointed at your head, and you won't do anything. I bring you right where you tell me you need to go, and you won't do anything. I just... I I don't even know anymore. You know what? Screw it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm going back. I, I've been needing to do this anyway. Set up my room in the Lucky 38, so I can actually do something. Ugh. Okay. You know what? This is actually a good thing. Because I can go get Boone, have him move into the Lucky 38 as well, because I think I can ha do that now. Uh, I think Victor said I could have Ooh. my, uh, yeah, yeah, have my followers stay over here, so I wouldn't have to go all over the damn place to pick them back up. Yeah. So that might, like, it might be a good thing. Just having them all here in a central location. I can go get Boone, bring him back over here. And then I can go get what's-his-face. What's-his-face. I forgot his name. I completely forgot his name. Victor, what was his name? Why am I asking you? You have no idea who the hell I'm talking about. The ghoul. The ghoul at Black Mountain. I'm sure he would love to come over here and move into this place. This is a nice place. A damn sight better than being the prisoner of, uh, now dead, uh... Where to, partner? To the penthouse... Uh, presidential suite. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, I think I'm going to do is come in here, buy up all the upgrades I can, assuming they're actually functioning. Crafting locker, buy it. Crafting locker, buy it. Buy a fridge, buy the guest wardrobes, buy everything. Uh, 1,400 capped. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So, buy everything. There we go. Exit. Let's see. Did that add a whole bunch of extra crap in here? No? Yes? Uh. Huh? What did that actually add? I don't know. thought it would add, like, uh, storage and stuff like that. Did it? Did it actually do that? Ooh. Oh. I think it added a whole bunch of these empty trunks and stuff like that. Ooh. I wonder if any if any of this stuff has like pre-war pre-war bonnet. I don't think she wants a bonnet. She wants a dress, like an actual dress. Uh, maybe there's a dress somewhere in here. Is there a dress I can give her? Pre-war casual wear. Uh, something like formal wear. I've seen formal wear around today's position. So maybe, just maybe, there's some here. If I can find it, I'll give it to her. Uh. Ooh, today's position. Okay. I was not expecting that. No, nothing. And there's nothing in there. Ugh. Okay. Well, what I think I'm going to do right now... Ooh, vending machine. This wasn't here before. Sesperilla. Sesperilla. So yeah, it did add a whole bunch of new stuff. Well, some new stuff. Not a lot of new stuff. Just a simple amount. 
like this, the crafting bench and the workbenches and the extra fridge, I guess. Oh. Okay. Well, not too bad, I guess. Not as uh, nice as it was in previous uh, Fallout 3, where I got to customize my custom house. But yeah. Ooh. Okay. Uh, let me see. What do I want to do? I think I'm going to empty out her inventory, empty out Eddie's inventory, dump everything into various places in here, and then come back. Because... crap. Oh. Okay, I just dumped out my inventory. I think I'm going to keep Eddie, simply because I like Eddie. And maybe I can get that coat hanger to uh, give him his own set of armor. Even if it's only decorative. Oh. But you, Veronica, I... I am just sick of it. <laughs> Look at that stupid, stupid cowl. You're wearing massive armor, and you're still wearing that stupid, stupid cowl. Ugh. Okay. Veronica, I'm sorry, but I think What's it's that? time for us to part ways. Uh, let's talk about tactics, craft something, let's trade. It's time for us to part Why ways. Why does everyone always say that? Because you won't f help me! I had a friggin' pulse gun, the thing you wanted, the thing we were supposed to go get, and you wouldn't do a damn thing with it. Ugh. I do. We'll meet up at the Loki 38. I just think about... I think we should right now. Uh, second thoughts to go for longer. Yeah, let's leave her here at the Lucky 38. Nice! Can I order room service? Yeah, sure, whatever. Go do whatever the hell you want. Uh, Veron Victor... Victor... Uh... I don't know. Damn it. That's a stupid hat. She has a stupid hat. You have a stupid hat! Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it, I'm just so pissed off right now. I roll sweet. Uh, okay, let's go back to the casino. You know what? I casino think... Floor. I think I'm gonna go get Boone and see if he wants to come over here. That way he's out of Novak, because Novak sucks. Novak is a sucky place. So let's head over to Novak. And, uh, yeah. Novak, searchlight. Where's Novak? Novak. Oh, wait. Novak? Where's Novak? Ah, here we go. Getting lost on the map right there. <laughs> oh, okay. Let us get Boone. Send him up there. See if he wants to be up there now. Uh, and then I think I will go get What's-His-Face over at Black Rock Mountain. Or whatever it's called. Manny. Manny! Uh... Boone! Boone, are you in your room, or are you up there? I don't know. I'm gonna see if he's up here first. Because it's nighttime, and he, he is usually up here at nighttime. Boone! Is it time? Yes, let's travel together. Um. Okay. Now I'm going to send you to, uh... That guy Benny was a piece of work. Yes, he was. Uh, let's see, tactics... Let's, uh, think we should part ways for now, Boone. We'll meet up at the Lucky 38. I'll make my way there. There we go. Goodbye, Boone. Have fun at the Lucky 38. Order some room service. Maybe take in a show. Who knows? Who cares? Ugh. But it is sad now that they just lost their other sniper. So they're all defenseless now. Huh. Okay. So. Uh, Black Mountain... Black Mountain? That's the name of it? Here we go. Let's see if this guy... This guy might actually be helpful. I mean, I wasn't able to help Boone, and Veronica wasn't able to help herself, and I, I am 0 for 2. I mean, I was able to help Eddie. I was able to help Eddie and get him done, and get his missions done. Uh, kind of just lucked out there, I guess. Kind of just randomly happened. But still, I got his stuff done. And he's happy about it. At least I hope he's happy about it. Maybe he's happy about it. I don't know. He can't talk. So that's, uh, that's a whole other thing. Hmm. But yeah. Let's see if we can actually get this guy and maybe help him. Uh, poor ghoul guy got captured by super mutants. Held captive. Forced to repair their random crap. And uh, beaten and assaulted. Uh well, hopefully 
we'll be able to do something with him. And maybe, just maybe, uh, he'll bring something new to our little group dynamic. What do you think about that, Eddie? Someone new for us to uh, have fun with. Uh, Raul! That's his name, Raul. Hello, Raul. Oh, it's you. You need something repaired or something? No, I actually thought maybe, just maybe, you'd like to come along with me. That is assuming you're not just going to stand there once we try and get your quest done and not actually help me complete it, even though I have the item you wanted, just Maybe standing there. Stand here. Let's go. Okay, well, he seems very enthusiastic about it. And luckily, I now have this awesome power armor, so I do not need my old and, quite frankly, great combat armor. I expect to be armor. by your dizzy mercantile sense, boss. <laughs> well, I hope you're awed by some awesome Mark II power armor. Well, not combat armor, not power armor. Because I don't think you can wear the power armor. Uh, hmm. What kind of weapons does he use? Ooh, looks like he's using a revolver. Hmm. I'm guessing he's a one-handed kind of gun guy. Let's see. Uh, stim packs. Ooh, I should give him some stim packs. Uh, keep distance. Let's give him some I'm stim sure packs, be just because. Equitable, boss. Stim packs. Uh, well, let's give him, like, five. I hope, I think, they can actually use stim packs. Uh, I want to see what he actually has to say. What do you have to say? If we run, we might still catch Benny. Well, you might. I'll just be wheezing along behind you. How do you know about Benny? Did, when did I tell you about Benny? I mean, I just met you. Well, I didn't just meet you. I met you a while back, but still. How do you know about Benny? That is, is just odd. Uh, wait here. Let's talk about your tactics. Oh, this should be good. Uh, I mean, what's on your mind, boss? Uh, combat, that's about how close you're following me enough about taxis. Oh, I just... Uh, tell me about yourself. Question I'd like to ask you. Uh... Head out with you. Let's let's ask him some questions. questions. Boss, you mean you don't know everything there is to know already? Uh, no. Uh, can you tell me anything about Mr. House? Do you know anything about a goon named Benny who wears a checkered coat? Apparently, he already knows something. Benny, huh? Sorry, boss. Doesn't ring a bell. Then again, my brain isn't as sharp as it used to be. Then how did you mention him earlier? I mean, is your brain really that damaged? What the hell? What the hell? How do you not know anything if... Uh, let's talk about something else. Oh. Uh, You're a very... Tell me about that house. What's your new CR? How do you feel about the Legion? New Vegas? I wanted to figure out what kind of weapons he likes to use. Because I have a massive assortment of weapons. I could give him something awesome. Because right now it looks like he's just using a crappy revolver. Uh... Though, with that being said, Veronica was fairly good with her power fist. And Boone had that nice sniper rifle he was using. But yeah, um, what the hell do I do now? Eddie, what the hell do I do now? I mean, the whole thing I was going to do was the full Brotherhood of Steel thing with Veronica, but now she's gone. Boone is gone. Now I have Raul, uh... What am I supposed to do now? I don't know. What am I supposed to do now? Quests? I have quests. I could make you care. No, I can't. Because apparently, that doesn't matter. Uh, well, I guess I could go talk about the boomers. Things that go boom. Uh, hmm. Well, I could go do that. Ah, heartache by the numbers. I still got that doing. Which is something, there was another one, a uh, debt collector. Kill Caleb McCaffrey, as apparently he's in one of the casinos. And that's part of the whole, uh, uh, heartache by the numbers thing, Crimson Caravan. So, uh, let's see, where is this? Ooh. Huh? What? Wait a minute. What? Debt collector. Find Lady Jane's caravan and collect craps from the remains. Kill Caleb McCaffrey. What? I'm confused. So, that one's in the casino. Brock Flower Cave? What the hell? Uh. 
Okay, let's go check out the Brock Flower Cave, apparently. Okay. Uh, apparently it's here? No. Uh. Oh, what the hell? Brock Flower Cave? There's nothing here. Maybe up here? On top? Up top. Up high. Oh, here it is. Here we go. Brock Flower Cave. Uh, what is your caravan doing inside here? Uh, was it hit by raiders or something? Uh, I know the cheap tricks of this. There's gonna be, like, traps or something down here, isn't there? Like, uh... What was that? Kind of a weird, uh... Is a spatula? Like a sound. Ooh. I have no idea. Uh. Oh. Am I even going the right way? Uh, local map? Aha. No. Yes, maybe. Uh, let's see. Is there anything down here? I'm not seeing anything, uh red, so I don't think there's any body down here. Just a bunch of green. Wait, I spoke too soon. There is a... a corpse. Jane's Brahmin! 276 bottle caps! Find Lady G's caravan, collects caps from remains. Huh! So who the hell dragged this in here and then just left it? I don't know. But, uh, yeah. I guess I will check out the rest of this cave, see what else is here, and then head back to the strip and uh, hopefully find something good. So what else is in here? Nothing? Nothing. There's nothing here. There's some red. Uh, no, nothing. Why are you... Go around the barrels! Dude! Ugh. Go around the barrels, and you'd have an easier time getting by. Ooh. What is all this? I don't know. Uh, okay, let's go out and see if there's anything interesting here. If not... Oh. Oh, it's just a rat. It's just a friggin' rat! Uh, ow. Rodent of unusual size. Did these rats drag that massive Brahmin in back into here? Is that what happened? Really? Because I'm not seeing anything other than giant rats. Oh. Ooh. What's up here? Uh, anything? Useful? No? Wait. Anything? Up here? No. No. Apparently there's something in here, though. There's lights. There's... giant rats. Chop. Chop. Chop, giant rat, chop! Ooh. They hit fairly hard. Or is that just my life? I haven't, uh, actually eaten or drink, drank anything. Huh. So what the hell is this? Huh. Computer work? No? Well, uh, programmers, physicians, and a rat slayer. Ooh, a rat slayer. What is the rat slayer? Rat Slayer? Uh... Campaign Sniper Rifle? Ooh, 308. Huh. 18 damage. 40 DPS. Ah, it's a sniper rifle, kind of. Though not quite as good as the Gobi Rifle. Huh. Well, it's a named rifle, so that's something. Huh? Not too bad, I guess. Worth coming in here. Uh, but yeah, it does beg the question, what the hell is this? Uh, huh. Oh, well, I guess uh, I will finish looting this place, check out the lower area where all those rats were, and then head on out back to... Uh, the old man will crawl around the dirt. Uh, here we go. I'll head back out to uh, New Vegas and see if we can actually find that other guy for this quest. Haha. <laughs>